And so I wanted to share with you this morning um, two books that I love. One is called Have You Filled Your Bucket Today? And the other one's called Bucket Filling from A to Z. Now, I want you to think about these buckets because this morning we're going to do a little bit of an experiment. Now, you can do this one at home with a family, but you need to make sure that you ask your mom or dad for permission to do it first and be sure to ask them for a little bit of help. I know even in our house, it took more than just me to make the, this experiment happen, but it's about encouragement. Do you know what encouragement is? Think about it for a minute. Encouragement means to give other people courage. And I know when other people give me courage, I feel like I can go out and do other things. And when that happens, that person then feels like they can go out and do something else and make other, somebody else feel courageous and so on and so on and so on. It becomes contagious and that is exciting. Let's back things up a little bit. When I started this experiment, I needed some empty cups. I needed some paper towels that I folded into three lengthwise. I needed a measuring cup that had water filled to one cup. I needed a spoon. And I needed some food coloring. I used red, blue, and green, but you can use whatever colors you have at home. Make sure you don't get the food coloring on your counter. That happened at our house. Anyway, watch what happens next. So if we think about this encouragement thing, like faith, we know that when we are feeling empty, like this cup here, all we have to do is be filled by other people. And when we offer other people encouragement, it spreads. It fills other people's bucket, just like in these books. And if you have a chance to get them, make sure you grab them. But we become contagious. We want other people to be filled with love. We want other people to be filled with joy and with grace and with caring and with all of the other amazing feelings that are out there in this world. So this whole month we're going to be talking about ways that not only can we be encouraged, but how we can encourage other people. How we can encourage other people to come to know who Jesus is. How we can encourage other people to stand up for what they believe to be true. How we can encourage other people to get to know who we are and through us, maybe getting to know Jesus even better. Doesn't that sound exciting? I hope you'll join me as we encourage you to meet us weekly here at church at 10 a.m. Have a great week, friends. Go out and be an encourager. Spread your love and spread God's love to each person you meet. Have a great week.